Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I am your host, Jay Voodoo Child, and we are playing Total War Troy. Uh, turn 56 of my Spartan campaign. Um, I've just fought a major battle, well, a, a significant battle, but I wasn't recording it. So I do have it on replay. I caught it just as the battle was ending that I wasn't recording, so I thought I would start recording there and do all the post loot screens or post battle screens and thought I hit record for that as well but it didn't go so I only have the replay to show you and what I eventually took over so let's just kind of go through that replays Fight battle? No, I don't. I'll just watch the replay. Alright, so they have lots of range. And just enough um, units to clog up the entry points, which of their four. I set my chariot over here, uh, my vanguards in here, uh, spears in here, hidden. I have my two javelins here. Um, and my runners back here, hero and militia over here. And they had a large group of range here, um, one javelin over here. And eventually my midnight runners got revealed. So they brought in a uh, archer, a slinger and a light, um, sword unit or, um, spear unit. So, um, first I was going to do some stuff over here, but then I decided my cooldowns and Malaeus, um, I would want to crack this guy, taunt him out, jump him with my militia, maybe eat some javelins. So I put this on hold, but Again, my midnight just got too close and was discovered. So here I'm ordering out Menelaus. Um, eventually, I want to kind of freeze these three slingers in place. So I pull out my spears over here. Um, once I do the taunt and get that set up, one of these regular slingers is going to come over here. Actually, no, it's the Renown that comes over here and starts shooting at the extremes of its range here. And I decided to bring in... The foe has shited your hidden units. Uh, ...my chariots, because they completely open up this door for me. The hero comes over here. The spear, I think, comes over here. I managed to get one of my spear units. Uh, unfortunately, it was the most experienced one past this guy on the taunt and started attacking this. They they ran off and so this, I believe, unit comes over to assist, locks down that militia. The um, javelins start to withdraw out of that fight. But by that time, my um, chariots are involved. And so I'm just getting way ahead on the commentary. All right, so yeah, they're exposed. I just did not not pay attention to that message. And here comes those supporting units. And what I should have done is just take a couple shots. And then once they get into range, but I was mostly trying to set up this engagement over here, so that's why I didn't do that. Your hero is under attack. So there's that one slipping through. We got the renown coming over, and I figured this was going to be a one-way ticket.
But yeah, still haven't noticed that these guys advancing, but that's not going to happen soon. These guys break fairly quickly. Um, I do throw on my um, threads of fate there. So again, they get locked down. The range starts pulling that back. Um, I still haven't noticed this, but it's going to be really soon. All right, so they've broken, and I've decided to try and save my more experience unit and do a pinch on this and try and get a black skull here. Unfortunately, these guys break too soon and um, I forget what I, I think I pulled them back. Your warriors are losing heart. So yeah, pulled my runners back to the woods. All right, here comes my chariots. So the heroes coming to save the day. More support from slingers. And so with hero, I can either pull back, but I decide to go interior and try and catch these retreating units here. Your warriors have been routed. So that's my second militia getting routed. And I'm gonna try and do a charge in there, try and get a skull going. But these guys are coming on strong. So I just do the one charge and then pass through. This guy, I was wondering if they were going to close the door here. Um, but no, they're going to go defend that, leaving me to come in here. Since I'm now charging with the chariots, I know these guys are going to come off the line and pull back to the center. So I start um, attacking with my javelins. This, my runners, I'm pulling up, but I don't pull them up far enough. So they're kind of out of the battle a lot. And so I'm kind of recharging here, waiting for the cooldown. And I'm just focusing on what my chariot can do. Just micromanaging that while my cooldown happens. So I'm not being chased anymore there. Not being closed the door here. Even though, oh wait, they're coming my way. So let me try and engage them. And I'm just gonna slip by them real quick. Um, one gets engaged, but with the knockdown, they are able to get through. And so I got two exposed range, but these guys are quickly coming in the rear. And then they've got their two sp um, slingers in here. And again, I'm trying to get rear shots because I know this guy's going to close the door on me. And unfortunately, I just kind of leave that one back there. Also, my slingers I left behind. Uh, at some point, I realized that this door is wide open. So I start bringing in my spears here. And eventually, I'm going to bring this group back in and try and taunt another unit. But yeah, now they're kind of mostly in full retreat and they're trying to get engaged with me. So they're no longer coming into my backside. But I've got four units here. And I'm just trying to finish off or get these routed before these show up unfortunately I'm just not getting enough rear shots um, let me pause it here okay yeah so I'm bringing my spears up through here I decided to bring in my vanguards I think put them in here and so I'm getting a reaction out of there also have I done anything with my Nope, nothing on the slingers. 
and nothing yet on midnight even though they're at the door so try and get some skulls but I've got youngs coming in here so I turn around come after that and just do a pass through the door is now closed on me but they are taking severe damage so even though these are spears they're running they're not brace i'm going to try and come through here and then go after these slingers while i close their escape all right um surprisingly these renowned get caught out by this advancing group um, I think this group was chasing the javelins, trying to get a taunt on them, but they just kept on retreating. Uh, I may end up doing a taunt here. So yeah, they're too busy trying to fire on my hero. All right. So I hit the line here with my chariots. I still have six. I think I'll probably lose one here. And I'm just trying to break through to this line. Meanwhile, I think I'm just running up here to try and get in a shot. And yeah, I finally got my spear runners moving up. And I think they are attacking this slinger here. as he's closed the door for this retreat. So just basically I'm gonna find my way through here. Yeah, I don't have a good angle. So you can kind of see how the battle progresses. And it's like, just get through, just get through, just get through, just see it through. Just keep charging here, keep charging here, keep charging here. So, yes, I did lose a chariot there, right there. And these were still firing on the spearmen, but it's the young spears that actually give chase. So I start switching targets to them. And then I think I change targets. Either keep that here or I go after the young spears. All right, so my back door is closing there. And so chariots are just gonna fight through this zone. All right, so there's their renown getting caught up. These guys are still advancing. These guys are still retreating. Uh, I forget which direction they're going. All right, so I got this militia coming back to the fight. They actually joined this group, I believe. Or no. They start chasing this renown slinger when they break. Yeah, that's what happens. So I can kind of get them set up on a line. So yeah, they're coming up the hill, getting in this fight. Here comes the hero. So the AI is concentrating right in here now. All right, so javelins are switching. So then they're getting shot. And their spear or their slingers slip through the back, so I start charging again with And these guys are retreating, but while I'm Victory looking at other close enough things to taste. they start trying to come back. These guys are broken. I figured the spears can pick them up. Um, my fast spear runners are going to chase down these slingers and finish them off. And my idea was to at least get these retreating. I'm starting to take bow fire. And yeah, uh, here. Now these guys are still. I forget what I'm doing here, but anyway, it was like, oh wait, these heroes are here. So let me bug out. Hopefully I won't lose any more chariots. 
and all my range is going to fire on the hero. So all I wish to do is kind of set up a line here. I have lots of problems with my mouse. And they start chasing the javelins as I'm still forming up a line. So they're going to try and do a rear track. All right, I did them taunting over here. Um, try and get some angles for flank and then I have one guy running around the back, but I think these guys break Again, I go threads of fate and Because I'm not taking any fire from anyone um, I do I'm spending all my rage on uh, I think increased crit uh, I turned off all my um, range attacks here because I didn't want to being thrown at this um, skull here or this skull here. And I'm just going to set up a line here while the militia chases them. Even though now that they are skulled, I think I'm going to eventually bring them over here. Actually, no, I'm going to chase each unit. That's right. So I bring this mil uh, militia over here to try and chase these guys off so I can have some more freedom down here. And finally, I'm bringing up my slingers. Once I realized that the bows were gonna be a problem, I started bringing up the slingers to trade with them since my slingers have longer range. All right, so they're chasing up my skirmish modes. Um, and so I decide to do a rear attack, even though I can't catch him. All right, your black dot. Um, I think I'm going to turn you around soon. All right, since this is not scold, I have my chariots um, finish them off. Again, they're retreating there. I got watch out for these these two range even though this is my disposable group right here all right so once they started turning around I started spreading out the spears one coming around here these two coming around here I'm going to continue getting some rear shots this one discharges in to set the front line and then once these start focusing on the rear they're going to stop attacking all right um chariot's trying to finish off them and i am taking some rear shots here but again i'm trying to bring in my militia to run these guys off and i just want to make sure that this group gets gold And unfortunately, I just forget about my midnight runners again. Or not my midnight runners, but my um, spear runners. So if you're fully, I'm fully confident that I'm gonna get this unit. And I th think they try and rush this to save them. Or maybe they're just responding to this. But um, yeah, these range hang out here and allow this charge. They don't run off, which I found surprising. So yeah, disposable militia, yeah, just go cause havoc. Um, they're about to break. Um, I figured they would be routed fairly soon, especially with these spears coming up, so. They're chasing that group until they got scold. Once they got scold, I'm start charging. But the spears got scold, and I forget what I do with this group now. So I'm kind of pulling this group back. I had another um, come back from retreat militia join in here. Uh, my yeah, the most experienced one. 
And yeah, I'm just getting these militia out of the way. Maybe I'm going to chase down the hero. All right, so that's gold there. Um, I decide that my fast midnight runners were going to get the champion kill here. And I started thinking about putting my spears over here and closing this door and just kind of doing a swarm attack on the center. And these guys are just sitting here doing nothing. Um, with this unit coming up and with this unit coming up, um, I'm bringing them forward here to set up another line. And just basically, I just want them to throw their javelins and just empty out their ammo before kind of choosing the attacks. So this unit ended up charging that. So I say, okay. And the skirmish mode. See, I never noticed that they routed. So where is my militia around here? Um, they're still chasing these guys for whatever reason. So yeah, I was going to bring my javelins over here. Um, have them start thinking. And... Then I decide that my chariots, which didn't have any experience at that point, was going to kill the general. But then they attack with this unit. Okay, so that's what happened. They retreated, came back. Okay, that's what's going on. All right. This, I believe this unit is split up and is trying to attack here and I brought my spears back here trying to get rear shots here. think they got this close wow I never saw that my hero taking damage Yeah, I never saw this going on.
<laughs> so there, yeah, replay is a little different than what I remember of the battle. But anyway, that's the episode. And hey, I'm recording. So that was that battle. Sorry about the amateur hour there. Um, where is the return? So let's replace my militia and try and get healed up and go Oh it is not in the same region as this. So, I can leave this as is. Nice. Alright. One, one. That'll be 51. So, dilute this experience a little bit. All right, there's still one. And let's see, is everyone else one? Indeed they are, so I'll be at full strength next turn. I've got two points available and I know I'm not going to get a chariot for them because the taunt ability is only by foot all right armor for all units that's nice spear units or missile units so those are not so nice eight percent damage all units and hero Shielded infantry. I think only my range is not shielded. So, this is the likely path there. What is this doing? Um, damage for the hero during ambushes or sieges. Land and ambush. Siege and choke point. I don't know what is a choke point battle. Uh, don't want these units fighting against Paris or Hector. Trojan culture or morale for the uh, hero. Um, so 103, I guess maximum is 150, I'm guessing. Or I could spend one point there. Even though, for the most part, I'm, I'm using the shield still, so... Let's just get this level 14 going. Alright. 
So, let's start spinning some wood. I decided I'm going to build up those city islands. Alright, I was going to do happiness here. And I think you are done. I just don't want to spend the resources to get these next years. Especially with that gold. I'm going to really need gold for my temples. Alright, get the last level there. your mud saving the temple slot uh, temple slot or am I waiting for four? Oh yeah that's right that was one thing I discovered this is only one turn so I can start my temples now so I'm gonna do my heroes here I need 645, so 223. I guess this light tower is not necessary. Actually, no, I do have garrisons there. one that's going to take two turns so we'll wait a turn there all right um where was that other building roads all right so that's buildings um this is mostly borders okay royal decree I'm going to get some extra rage. Um, I still have not activated my 75 rage ability. So the terror for 30 points morale or something like that. So I did repair this, meaning to build on it. Um, what other buildings that I get started? You can wait. All right. So do an end of turn save. Looking good on time. Um, see, level up. So yeah, brothers launching an attack. Uh, Helen's still on the island where the surf boys started out at. So I imagine she will be captured soon. Unfortunately, unless I capture her, she's just gonna stay put wherever she is. 
but that's going to freak out Harris and he's going to beeline to her so hopefully my brother's AI is smart enough to, to set up their overwhelming force and ambush him and just take Paris out of the game as a fighting force So, what are you going to do differently? I mean, your three sack really isn't strong enough to do anything. There's no mercenaries in this game. So, the agent might cause a little havoc. Uh, envoys, they reduce the influence. So that's really not important to me at all. So he can waste his food that way as well. Alright. Pylos is sending up an army to do something. some point Dardanian was sending a seven stack to Rhodes I'm not sure whether that's happening anymore all right So you are building, I got 3,000. Let's get, where was I happy I'm building? Yeah, right here. So that come online at the same time. I think I just started doing that for kicks. why they are so fast. Um, so very soon I'm going to be recruiting heroes. i go for diplomacy next. Got a thousand wood left. I mean, do we bank it? bank this wood.
All right, so in that case, let me double check your position. So yeah, you're there getting experience. And rank four in one battle, that's amazing. With fortitude, for vengeance. So, I did not like the layout of this, so I am definitely going to just lay siege, wait three or four turns. Make them pay! And that will be that. Um... You know what? I'm not going to do that. I'm going to... So I did not save that properly. In different segments. So I'm going to start at the beginning of the turn, unfortunately. And try and remember where I did the buildings. So roads. And then the happy. I think that was it. And the um, envoy thing in my home region. of Sparta. All right, I'm going to do B buildings. And I'm going to ambush. Draw their eight stack. I've a wrong to write. Closer. Hmm. I remain undaunted. Always honorable. Maybe not ambush, but... They can land here. Menelaus of Sparta! Oarsman! So yeah, I'm going to just hang out here. Let's see how that goes. All right, peace negotiated. All right, they're working things out up there.
my mark. Leave it to me. To war. Set an ambush. So, that gate may give my wood garrison a turn or two of building before they have to face the 8th stack. Or if they don't see me... Oh, okay. They made peace in one of my earlier runs. So, I get another wood there. Alright, so there's that 7th stack... And they are coming up to fight. It's going to take them a while, but thank you. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to do some damage to Dardanians. Ah, this is nice. Unless I get too... All right, that's not nice. What do we want to do? Alright. Definitely going back to a load. So I think Phyllis is too far away to do an attack on Kos. So they're just going to make So just late siege and give up cause. Menelaus of Spot. I mean I haven't spent anything there, so Strike hard. Show no fear. All right, got a priestess coming in. I'll take that open battle straight up. There, 
22 versus my 20. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to lose Kos, Kos, however you pronounce it. The question is, are they going to make peace or um, sack that wood by my home province? We shall see. Sack it is. No. They just looted it. And probably made peace. And again, if I lose there, I will not have to fight the tower. Because it will be a level one at that point. I mean, all you can really do is raid. Which I guess is something. Target? I guess you do. Two hundred fifty with any favor of the gods, so. Yep. Peace there. Alright, that's interesting. Kind of bizarre, but okay. Alright, so they're just chilling out there. I'm going to fight this. So that's probably going to be on the next episode since we're coming up on the hour here. Alright, holding the siege, doing nothing there. Let's build some buildings though. Okay, over and roads. So next turn I'll have that, 350 gold, so I can do two temples, but I probably only need the one, maybe I need another four someplace. Okay, um, 3,000. Let me just build these ports.
So plus two recruitment of invoice. That's what I'm trying to equal. Oh. I'm going to save this for when we have invoice. Because that's rather expensive there. Um, do we want to repair this damage? Sure, why not? Garrison here had not moved. I saw I set them on ambush. I guess my... Safe scumming has got me confused. And I think you're already lazy. So again, another thing I like about epic. the advancements in Troids is once you move in Force March or March, other games it would lock you in, not this one. As long as you still have not exceeded your normal movement you can switch to to other things that I find really nice so I'll do a quick save there all right see ambush The start of the next turn, I'll take a look at Brother's progress. See if he's captured any land up there. Eventually, I'll get line of sight up there and can kind of keep an eye on things. But that will have to. Ah, right. Will it? I guess I would fight this only to try and eliminate that one unit. <laughs> I mean, they've taken some serious attrition loss. So, yeah, I will fight this out on the next episode. Stay tuned. Coming to you tomorrow at 9 a.m. Central Standard, or excuse me, Eastern Standard Time in the United States, North America. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and don't mind my save scumming to kind of create ideal situations for myself and make up for tactical mistakes on how AI responds to my moves. So, uh, like and subscribe, um, click the bell icon for future drops, and I will see you on the next one. Take care.